we're just like, life isn't hard enough. Yeah. Let's make life worse. Will we both fit on this thing? I don't know. Okay. The swinging is a metaphor for how we swing back to our old experiments. Okay. See? Yeah. I had nothing but good things to say about quitting the internet last time. I don't miss social media at all. <laughs> Stop being adorable, I'm trying to talk. I think I'm a happier person. For like two weeks now already, I just stopped on my own. I've read two books in the last two weeks and I have probably not read two books in the last two years before this. No alcohol also, I had really nothing but good things to say about that. Most of the month did not miss alcohol. I still think that no added sugar is gonna be the hardest of the three. We only have 18 days to go, so <laughs> wait. Third, it was 31 days in July, right? So 19 days to go. Only 19 days to go. I'm not gonna lie to you. I really want some M&Ms right now. So uh, why are we doing it? To jumpstart a habit that I would like to incorporate into my life more. Having you as an accountability buddy, because I have very poor willpower. Every time we do these, I permanently improve my habits, but it has sort of creeped back. Maybe it'll improve it even more. Yeah. Which brings us to the explanation of our rules. Hi, Brick Wall Craig Narrator here. We are more lenient this time than we were those other challenges. The goal here isn't some sort of torture experiment. It's to develop habits that could last forever. So we don't want to make it really hard so that we quit. First, sugar rules. One, no added sugar. Um, you need sugar to live, checkmate. That's one of my favorite hundred comments from the last time we quit sugar, and probably this time as well. To explain added sugar once again, we can eat sugar that occurs naturally in things like fruit, milk, vegetables, B-52 songs. We just can't have food with added sugar in it like nearly every packaged food on the planet. Ketchup, most bread, dressings, all that stuff probably. And unfortunately we cannot eat the St. Louis Cardinals, the Philadelphia Eagles, or the Detroit Lions because at various points they added Leo sugar to their roster. Thank you, Wikipedia. No fruit juice or other foods that take all the sugar from all the places where it naturally occurs and robs it of lots of its nutrients and fiber and good things. We are allowing one kind of juice though, juice by Lizzo. Juice, alcohol rules, I don't put the rules down, it just looks like I'm saying alcohol rules, but I'm not. No alcohol, that's it, that's the rule. Well, there's one exception. Our anniversary, like a one bottle of champagne Cheat. Cheat. Social media rules. Last time we did this, it was no internet and we were way more strict. This time, it's just social media. The Twitters, the Facebooks, the TikToks, the Blick Blocks, the Bleak Blorps. I did say that YouTube was okay. Okay? Live with it. I can also use Bleep Blorp. Now, back to us in our element. Let's swing now as if this is what we're gonna do the rest of the day once the camera goes off. Okay. Wee! All day long. Wee! Wee! Towards the end of day two here, I went for a run. I was famished. I had to stop and walk because I was so hungry. I get this quick urge to grab some chocolate, grab a cookie. It's something like that. It's not a healthy snack. We had just eaten dinner. We ate plenty. Mm -hmm. We were full. Oh yeah. Full of food, <laughs> not full of sugar. So I had some peanut butter toast with banana on it. It was delicious and I still want more. I feel like I could eat bananas all night. Like my stomach fills up, but I don't feel sated. Half the time that you offer to make me a cocktail, I will say no. But now that I can't have it, I definitely want one. <laughs> yeah. Every day from now until the day I die. Were we like tired before? Yes, day four was terrible. Came down with a case of the want to dies. China, want to react to how you felt on day four? No. That was perfect. I didn't think it would be as bad because I didn't think I was having as much sugar, but I might be wrong. <clears throat> I feel kind of the same I felt last night. I feel like I want more foods in me. You know what sounds good? Hard boiled egg, sriracha on it. Does I could see sugar that. Sugar on it? Sriracha, probably. I'm gonna go with I was at a point where I, I was editing and I wanted to take a break and my gut reaction was to Go look at Twitter. And like, well, what should I do? I'll take a walk. And then I got you and Ada and we all took a walk. And it was way better than looking at social media. Go ahead, swear. This is bullshit. This is the third time at least that this has happened. Total sugars, zero grams. And then I look at the ingredients, chili, sugar, salt. What does that mean? I'm confused. Yep. And I'm upset and I feel betrayed. So wow. we can't have sriracha, well, can we not? maybe we can find an alternative. Uh, hang on, wait, 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 wait. Waiting, gotta go to the bathroom. Chili, 
garlic sauce. Again, sugars, zero grams. This one does not list sugar as an ingredient. See, you just gotta get creative. That's before October, 2018. <laughs> Maybe we get more creative. You have to go pee. I do, bye. Now I'd like to take a moment to thank the sponsor of this video, my face. Oh, the other thing, Blinkist. One of the hardest things about quitting social media is you can't distract yourself with dumb social media things. Like you're waiting in line, oh, what's on Twitter? You're pooping, what's on Twitter? You're pooping while waiting in line, oh, what's on Twitter? But if you can't check social media, what do you check? The news, yikes. Your friend's blog, boring. I'm sorry, your friend's blog is just really boring. But Blinkist is the perfect solution. They take the best insights from over 3,000 nonfiction books and condense them down to 15 minutes. You can read them or listen to them, which is like taking insights and making them out sounds. <laughs> they have over 14 million users. I actually know all the users and I'm gonna name them right now. Gary, Cheryl, Big Tuna, Paco, Sue. I actually named all of them, but I had to cut for legal reasons. It's many years later now. And you can get access to all titles offline, which is great for when China kicks me out and I have to live in a cave. Some blinks that were really helpful for our challenge. The unexpected joy of being sober. Relevant. The case against sugar. Relevant. The filter bubble. Relevant. The first 100 people to go to Blinkist.com slash WheezyWaiter linked right down there will get one week of full access for free to try it out. If you want to go to a full membership, you get 25% off. So you can stop reading your friend's boring blog while you poop while waiting in line. And you can read Blinks right along with Big Duna and Cheryl and Gary and Joe. I named them all again. Wow, I miss my family. Now, back to your regularly scheduled no sugar, no alcohol, no social media challenge. Today was pretty good. <clears throat> and then right around 7.30ish, real tired. But this is around when I should get tired. Maybe a little early. Still got that hunger, but it's not as bad. I feel great. I've started intermittent fasting. This isn't hard enough. I yeah. need some other crap to do. Yes. Well, it's easier. In the evenings, I don't really have many options anyway. I want to do it longer than a month. Yeah, I don't want to do that, but... <laughs> <laughs> the last time we did this, too, you eventually were like, I don't even really want it anymore. And I was <laughs> like, yeah, I still want it. An old-fashioned M&M's, marshmallows, some graham crackers for a while. I've done three of these spin classes now in the past week, which is unlike me. You seem like right now you have more energy. And I feel great. Good. This has turned into an exercise video. Okay. A whiskey. Yeah. Like a good whiskey. Put a little few drops of water in it. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Not for the buzz, but for the taste. I don't miss any of it that much. I don't no. need it. In the evenings, I'm like... Mm, I could go for a drink right now. Oh, I can't have a drink. Okay, maybe I'll have ice cream. Oh, I can't have, what can I have? Oh, nothing. Mm -hmm. It's getting weaker though. It's getting yeah. weaker. And I'm losing weight. I am exercising 100% more. Yeah, alcohol keeps me up later. Sugar keeps me up later. Mm -hmm. Social media keeps me up later. I'm not doing any of those, so I'm going to bed earlier. And that's helping me feel better. This is a month where I would have been sucked into social media pretty oh, hard my God, many times. So bonkers. There's a lot of major events, uh, but I'm still hearing about them. I'm still reading about them. When Ruth Bader Ginsburg died, I did go check Facebook and Twitter. Two minutes, I scrolled through. It was exactly what I would expect people to have been <laughs> saying. Okay, well, I don't need to see any more of this. I'm doing this the rest of the year. I want to get rid of this belly. Upon further research, I actually do need a belly to live. So I'm just going to try to reduce the size of it anyway. Back to Craig. How you doing, past Craig? All in all, great. Good. This is great. Yeah, you said that already. I'm notice. I'm noticing that you feel better. Yeah. Are you noticing that I'm feeling better? No. Nah. You're the same in a. Am I man spreading this whole time? Probably. Oh jeez. What's happening there right now? I'm using ketchup. What? Four grams of added sugars, and also. I don't care. Here's my reaction. That's fine. You do what you gotta do. I made it longer this time, I think, than I did last time without starting to cheat. Okay. It's our anniversary. Woo! Woo! It's a cheat day. But we also biked a lot. Oh yeah. I'm a little tipsy and I feel worse. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, I'm a little uncomfortable. Antsiness or something. I think my blood sugar's up and it just feels a little, ugh. Yeah, like I feel a little restless and tired and I just don't like it. I don't, I don't either. Like so you're never gonna have alcohol again? I think I will have it significantly less. But... At this angle, my head looks enormous. <laughs> and mine looks really small. Enormous. Let's try to do like a forced perspective thing. 
It's fun to it's be fun. laying directly next to you. It's fun to put my head right next to your head. Mm-hmm. It's so fun. <laughs> to go. Ah. Oh, thank you. Oh, that feels really good. It feels really good, actually. Yeah. How about a little up here? Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. That's good. <laughs> so China and Ada left. They left me. They're visiting family in Kentucky, China's family. Finding myself more tempted to eat sugary things, more tempted to ha- do social media, probably because no one's around, but I'm, I'm fine. Watching TV, doing laundry, and just thinking about not eating or drinking things. Today is technically the last, actually technically today I could go back to it. I'm not going to, and I'm still not doing it. I've gone to Twitter a tiny bit and I feel great. I've been able to drink alcohol for five days and I still haven't. But now I'm watching a Packer game with my family, so. Cheers. Cheers. Beer. Beer. It's been a while. And it's been a while. I don't know. I haven't had that much beer yet. While she was gone, China didn't get any footage, but she did send me pictures to prove that she wasn't cheating. Uh, yes, she was che- absolutely cheating. But that's okay. We gotta be realistic. Different rules for different ghouls. You know what I'm saying? I'm not sure I do. Okay, it's time for a little end discussion. I've gone back to having some drinks, but not every day. And usually when I do have a drink, I'm like, eh, I just don't feel as good. I crave alcohol less now than ever in my life. Mm -hmm. And this has been a great thing to do. Mm -hmm. Gone back to having a little sugar. And also like, I regret it basically every time. While we were in Kentucky, your mom bought s'mores and then I had some and I was like, oh crap, this is really good. And then I had more. Mm-hmm. And then I felt really sick. <laughs> like, I haven't had any um, like M and M's yet. I haven't gone back to the M and M's. I'm mostly sticking to what I've been eating, which is just. <laughs> you cheated a few times with sugar. I'm not even sorry. <laughs> so I didn't have any like desserts. We weren't as strict with ourselves about minuscule amounts of added sugar. Went back to social media as soon as the month was over. After I posted something, had the urge. Did anybody say anything? Did anybody say anything? So I deleted all of it again. I started going to Twitter and my browser on my phone. That's the beginning of the downfall. I'm gonna try to push it away again. I didn't read as many as many books as I wanted to. Just like last time, I got addicted to crossword puzzles. I am now addicted to the New York Times crossword app, though. I should work on that. Maybe I need to quit crosswords for a month. I read like two books in the first week, and then I just started watching YouTube videos. YouTube was still okay. I found these like rusty antique restoration videos would put me to sleep like Mm. super fast. Mm -hmm. Magic sleepy dust. It feels different this time. To me, I think this has been the most life-changing challenge. When I started this, I weighed about around 180, and now I weigh around 172. Wow. I'm drinking less alcohol, eating less sugar than ever in my adult life. I feel like it's going to stick permanently. Yeah. I wonder if it's because we were more lenient, trying to make it more realistically a part of our lives, but also maybe just because we've done it multiple times now. Yeah. Any final thoughts? Kind of want some eggs. You want me to put sugar on them? You want me to put alcohol on them? Mm, You want me to put social media on them? No. All right. It worked. Yay. Thank you for watching. If you liked it, hey, why don't you click like? And subscribe and leave a comment. Let's see if something bad to say. Put that on bleep floor. Here's a playlist of all of our previous challenges. YouTube thinks you'll like that video. I have a Patreon if you'd like to support me. I do a video every single weekday. Thanks for watching. Next video will be why do people like being married?